Hey everybody, it's Triple L. Hey, we're back. We're back on the channel. We're finally uploading on the original Triple L channel. I got my channel back today. I am very happy. I'm very excited. I am <laughs> relieved. All the stress that I had over this, it's dissipating slowly and now we're back in action. Um, things will be happening again here on the channel. Um, there are so many things I want to say, but uh, I want to keep this video a little bit short. It's just pretty much the Triple L character talking on the screen. Um, it's a pretty simple one. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, the channel came back. Um, the copyright strikes have been removed, so I'm at a relatively clean slate again. Ideally, the people that struck me this time don't come back and strike me again. So for everyone that supported me and uh, was giving me um, good well wishes and all that uh, i want to say thank you so much and because i'm really grateful i do want to point out just the people some of the people that uh, spoke up and uh, were there with me um for sure james rock i want to say thank you to it's no gravity i want to say thank you to vlack i want to say thank you to brian s i want to say uh, thank you to Giovanni Mora. I want to say thank you to Ryanick. I want to say thank you to Straw Hat Asta. I want to say thank you to Alan Baraza, Hideyoshi Kinoshita, um, QWR6. I can't pronounce that. Uh, bro, oh, Brodians. I want to say thank you to Brodians as well. Uh, Real Sean, Replica Rabbit, uh, SSJ1K, uh, The Levi Face, and uh, other people like uh, Angry Anime Fan and uh, Charles's Anime World. Um, I'm trying to go through uh, everyone I had listed down. If I missed anyone, I am I apologize. Um, other people, Invader Rin, also thanks to you. Mm, let's see how much more we got here. Uh, if I rec if I don't mention someone's name, I apologize. I might miss a name or two. I want to say thank you to the people over on the Discord server as well. Of course, TGC, Skelly, Prowertastic, Ali, uh, Doctor Zach, H Dragon, uh, Leo. Julia, uh, Julia, Peachy, uh, guys on the on the Discord server. I'm gonna miss a lot of people because I just can't go through everyone. I hope I said Skelly. I think I said Skelly. Uh, but yeah, um, overall, uh, we got the channel back. So what did I learn through this whole experience? The taste of desperation. That's that's pretty much what I learned. I learned what it is to feel super desperate again. Or it wasn't really learning. It was more like being reminded of what it feels. To be desperate um, I learned that uh, the business just sucks I, I, I learned that copyrights um, rights holders are some of the worst businesses to have to deal with man and like man, the people that struck me down they did it on Shueisha's behalf according to the information that I got because to to deal with the whole copyright strike process, I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about it. Uh, you have to like send it off to YouTube and YouTube's like, okay, come on, give me your uh, address because these guys might want to sue you. Um, we're going to send it over to them. We're going to see if they want to take legal action. And look, the, the, the truth is no one wants to take legal action on a small time YouTuber, right? It's a waste of time and they stand to lose more than they do to gain because... We could argue that I'm much, I'm probably in fair use. There was one thing that someone pointed out in one of the videos that I am guilty of, and that is technically um, we get our chapters ahead of the street date. So technically I am showing material that shouldn't be out on the street um, whenever we're making the videos. Uh, because of that, that does, I, I do think that does open me up. So in the future going into those videos, I might be a little bit more careful with it because that is something legitimately that it could take me down on um if i was in japan uh, i would and, I, and if they followed me and they tracked my ip i would probably be in trouble because japan's really aggressive with the piracy or the anti-piracy their anti-piracy -pir measures but that's neither here nor there um i don't have to deal with that for now um going back into the whole thing with uh, these people that were copyright striking um, from what I understood these guys have a they're a general firm um, they typically do rights management for a lot of companies um, I did research on them and I found that other people who owned general websites uh, got copyrighted by them or got copyright uh, notifications um, and, th and this is a general they're out there in the wide internet doing their business so what that tells me is that these people are most likely contractors working for Shueisha and I don't know if they're trying to get a contract with Shueisha or if they are already working for them but from the way it looks like 
you know, they take down one of the Hero Academia videos and they can go to Shueisha and say, hey, look, we took down this video that had your material, um, thousands of views or so far. See, we're doing a good job. Um, they could be selling it to them like that, but really, um, given how lack, how much of a lack of response they showed and given how this just they forced just waited it out and didn't um, uh, reply to any of my emails um, that tells me they're probably getting swamped with copyright notifications maybe or they're just ignoring their email and one of the cool one of the things for sure is that they have Shueisha's backing because either that or they're just playing a really good con game there's always a possibility for con but like the company itself did have a history and it was a trackable history so I hope I don't run into them again in the future. They don't seem to be very savvy with YouTube um, because the how they struck me down and the pattern with which they went after me tells me that they're not they're not super YouTube literate. And also like looking at some of their cases, um, some of the stuff that they struck websites for seemed pretty weak, but that might just be from the little cases that I found. Anyway, uh, not the point. The reason I'm talking about this though is because like in the, in the inside I'm thinking like this is probably a really good business plan. If they if Shueisha actually hired them, they're probably getting easy money because like they're not doing a really great job, but at the same time like they're do they're getting paid by Shueisha to uh, knock people down. If they have like a proper if it's a proper business and it's a legit business and it's not someone just playing a prank, of course. Cuz you know, everything could be thrown aside if it's just someone being a troll. Uh but that said, I wonder to myself if I could be one of those people, you know, if I could be a copyright manage or a copy a copyright management person. Uh, I would I would I would I would rule with an iron fist, man. I I would the power would get to my head. I wouldn't strike down anyone legit like say Chibi Reviews or anyone like that because that's stupid. I just if if I, if I had the power, I'd just go after the channels that are clearly just taking a, a piece of an episode and just uploading it because like man really when it's them like one thing is like appreciate that they have not been caught because it's like okay you guys are pretty good and you know how to get past the algorithm but at the same time it's like well it's, it's you shouldn't be upset if someone catches you for like the obvious you're making it too easy to catch you kind of thing and now i'm now i'm just kind of ranting um the video's already gone for eight minutes uh um the only reason i'm saying that is because like may you know i'm gonna make this a 10-year plan i'm gonna try and see if i can get up to a point where I can become that kind of person because at least if I have the power to be able to strike down people's channels at least I probably won't abuse it for the first three months and that that means a lot I think okay jokes aside though um, little fantasies aside uh, channel be is back to normal I think everything will be more or less okay um, new content will be coming out um, we're gonna be covering a. I'm gonna be trying to cover a lot of anime. Um, I'm gonna be uploading a video on this channel that I put on the emergency channel about um, what's coming up for this upcoming season and see what you guys all think at large. And overall, um, yeah, I'm happy that the channel is safe for now, and uh, I'm happy to see uh, where we go from here. Uh, I would like to show you a pre like clips of like other little videos I've been working on on the download but um, I don't know I'm not sure if those videos are good enough yet so just keep a, uh, 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 keep an eye out and I'm also thinking about starting a bunch of mini channels um, for different topics so if that's something that uh, you might be interested in the future just keep an eye on the channel I will put announcements whenever I make a smaller channel anyway guys that's it thanks for watching let's call it there till next time I hope you have an absolutely great day because my day is starting to be a little bit better now